it's nice to hear you say how you want to earn that opportunity. Uh, you've also praised Michael Michael Elgin in this interview. You know, one of the things I wanted to ask you is how do you feel about Michael Elgin really just walking almost right into that world title picture here and getting this title opportunity against Cage at Slammiversary? I mean, well, you got to think about it. Michael Elgin is a former world champion in uh, various uh, promotions, uh, Ring of Honor, uh, he was the first uh, never open weight champion in New Japan Pro Wrestling. Uh, Michael Elgin, uh, various times like killing it, PWG. Uh, the guy is a nonchalant like wrestler's wrestler. His wrestling IQ is higher than any wrestlers that I've ever been in the ring with. And that is uh, a full little one like, like uh, I'm telling the truth there. Michael Elgin is a beast for him to come in and do what he did to Brian Cage. Uh, I, I'm sorry that Brian Cage got injured, but you know, it was a huge acquisition for impact wrestling. Um, and right now that's what impact wrestling needs is stars like Michael Elgin. And for him to not just come in and say, Oh, I'm going to come in and uh, earn my spot. You know, that's not my deal, but, Michael Elgin, he said, hey, I'm pushing everybody to the wayside. And they're getting this spinning power bomb, and I'm putting you in the hospital. That's not how I would do things, but that's how he does things, you know?